Well, the reason why uh, the speculation reform did not work in the past is because, of course, Wall Street uh, is literally printing money. And they, they have an army of lobbyists in Washington, D.C. And this goes to the heart of the problem that Americans are facing across the country. The entrenched interest uh, across the country, and here we're talking specifically about Wall Street, uh, the financial sector, the, the, the stock brokers. I don't really want to pick on any companies, but just to give the public an idea of who we're talking about, we're talking about Goldman Sachs. We're talking about J.P. Morgan. We're talking about all of the, the big trading houses on Wall Street. They are lining their own pockets. They pay lobbyists in D.C. They donate to House campaigns and Senate campaigns. They donate a lot of money. We're talking about hundreds of millions of dollars to protect their uh, cash flow. But the problem with this system is... Um, they win and everybody else on the planet loses. So, so don't get me wrong, we need Wall Street. We want companies to invest. We want people to invest in American companies. We want to build American capitalism, but we must do it in a way that's smart and rational. So within the financial world, uh, we call the type of investing that I'm talking about we call it the Warren Buffett style of investing. So, you know, as everyone knows, Warren Buffett loves to buy stocks. He hates to sell them. <laughs> so, so he buys them and literally holds on to them for decades. And, and then he rides the appreciation and the growth of the company. And, and of course, along the way, he does sell stuff. But in, the, in terms of speculation, speculators might be in, in the markets for minutes or seconds. Uh, they might be in and out of trades a thousand times a day. There is no useful end result to the society by allowing speculators to do that. They are simply grabbing profits from the markets, they're lining their own pockets, and everybody else is paying the price. So that little reform, you know, it's very easy, it's a very simple one or two page law, can lower commodity prices, so food commodities, uh, usable uh, 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 industrial uh, commodities, as well as oil and gas, that makes everybody's life that much better, instantaneously almost. So, so Wall Street's going to be one of those reforms. I probably went into more detail than you were hoping for, but it, when you talk about this, these types of reforms, it's just better to, to lay it out.